Okay, it's time for a new pickups video, and it's of a um, bath sulk, and it's from a company called I Love Wellness, um, part of their sleep bath sulk range, and it's of um, it's with um, natural essential oils of lavender and chamomile. Now I got this from my local Holland and Barrett's. Um, I don't have all the Holland Barrett's I've got it in um, in the branch, but in my one. They have a, a reduced aisle where they have products where they reduce. I don't know whether it's the fact that they're just getting rid of them because they don't they don't want them anymore. Now this was not would normally go for it says there's seven ninety nine, but I got this for three ninety nine and it was actually the last one. And I was back in um over the last few months, I was really I really wanted to then try this out. But what kind of put me off was the actual price <clears throat> that put me off. But I did want to sit there and try it out at some point and again um i said before it was 7.99 dropped to 3.99 and I, as you can see on the label there it does say discontinued so i'm taking it they, they're not doing it anymore um <clears throat> I, I seem to be doing a lot of um lavender and um, base products on my channel um i've been in the video now i don't know if for example um, in what order I'll be releasing half these videos in, but you'll sit there and notice the lavender theme with these particular videos, so you you'll you will see that. Now I'll probably try to upload them in in order, <clears throat> but yeah, what I do love about lavender is that um, the properties of lavender is that they tend to have a calming um, effect, or should I say properties. So, for example, if you're somebody that's um, going through a lot of stress or having trouble sleeping um lavender the lavender extract um is very good at helping you kind of relax and even sleep and now the very different products that you can get they range in terms of the purity of of the lavender so some of the um you can get obviously lavender oils and even then there's some different types of um there's different strengths of um pure impure the, the purities of, of lavender oil but it, it but lavender oil is very good when i was a kid i used to get a lot of um my, i used to suffer from a lot of migraines as a child and um what i used to so i had to go in a really dark room and then using like lavender on on like your rubbing on my forehead and on to, to, to uh, on my temples actually used to sit there and help um get me to sleep and then i would wake up and it would be practically would would be gone and also um what i also used to do as well on top of that is drink chamomile tea now chamomile tea i know it's not to everyone's taste because it's very can have a very bitter taste but what i would do is I'd, i would add, add like a couple spoonfuls of honey so in conjunction with using them um, lavender oil and then using chamomile drinking chamomile tea um i found it a very calming um um products that actually helped and again as before when i had the migraines and i used the lavender oil and the camar tea it totally got rid of my migraines so i'm very interested to see in obviously that this product obviously is lavender based but also contains extracts of chamomile which i naturally assumed was only you know something that you would only have in tea i didn't think it would be something that you could put inside of a bath sulk or maybe in a balm or whatever things but there seem to be seems to be a lot of um things going on in the health in the health side of things these days where a lot of things um have um many um, different properties whether it's um like a bath sulk or it's a cream or you can have it as a tea um they seem to have all these very good healing properties and the younger me when i was much much younger um wasn't for it was only that things that hippies do when it comes to like this herbal stuff but they, they really do seem to work and especially in this day and age where you know life can be stressful you feel run down or you've got uh, multiple health problems so these things really do work it's just obviously the price and you have to kind of have to pay <clears throat> um the size of it is it's a 500 um milliliters so that's 16.9 fluid ounces as I said, it says in the front, it's a bath salt with um, natural essential oils of lavender and chamomile. So I'm, I've got high hopes um, for this particular product. And it says here, 98% natural derived, plant-based cleansers, rich in essential oils, 
bottle made for 100% recycled materials, um, brackets PCR, PCR, and 95% biodegradable ingredients, and it's suitable for vegans, so if you're not going to eat it. So, if you're someone that's vegan, um, it's pretty safe to use this product, and also it's made in Britain. And it says, um, prepare your body and mind for a, a restorative night's sleep with the I Love Wellness Sleep Bath Sulk. Formulated with extracts of aloe vera and chamomile, our moisturizing bath salt is expertly blended using chamomile, lavender, and lavender essential oils. I've never heard of lavender. Um, creating a bath experience that soothes and restores the mind. This luxurious bath soak will leave your skin feeling cleansed and moisturized and silky smooth. Directions, pour desired amount into running water um, for a soothing and relaxing bath. And you can see there that um, the I Love um, Cosmetics UK have got their own website. They have their own um, Facebook um, site, Twitter or X as it's known as, and Instagram. So it's kind of great. As I said before, um, it's been discounted, so it used to be seven ninety nine. It's three nine, so it's a four pound saving. Again, it's something that I wanted to try. I'm gonna take these labels off. Um, something that I've wanted to try. Um, but as I said before, the price was kind of what put in. I mean, these things, herbal things, do come come out of cost. And so, um, it, one of the worst things that I always fear is that you go off and pay a lot of money for a product and then it doesn't work. I mean, you feel like you just waste a lot of your money. Whereas if you haven't spent a lot of money on something, then, it, then it's no loss, no no fuss. But when you spend a lot of money on something, then, you know, it's something, and you know, you, you, especially if at that price, you feel like you've wasted your money. So without further ado, we'll open this up. As you can smell. Oh, it smells delicious. I thought you would need it. Obviously. Oh, I can definitely smell the lemon. This definitely, when I say this from the essential oils, I I absolutely believe, I actually do believe them because you can tell the difference between when someone's used in the pure essential oils to someone's just used the extracts of it. You can tell the difference because the strength of the actual smell. I can definitely um, smell the lavender. And I can smell the slight hint of chamomile, chamomile, especially if you've had the tea. It does have this um, distinctive um, smell to it. And I can definitely smell, it smells like the oil, even though it's a bath salt. But it definitely, I can definitely smell it. It's really strong. Mm. I'm, I am really looking forward to trying this product out. Product out. Um, I'm just, I'm fortunate that I managed to not only get it at this um particular price but i was lucky enough um to get the last one and i was if and biting and whether or not i should and i thought if you know i may as well um get it because i'll end up not um you know wanting it and then regretting it that it's not there and especially as that my local holland barracks now has closed down for a month they're re reopening back up on the 17th of april because they're closed for um they're, they're having a refit so I'm, so you know it would have been 50 50 whether it still would have been there or not but I'm glad I um, definitely picked up. But what I do like about this particular item, and I did a video with the Cousins Imperial Leather Lavender Sulk, is the fact that not only um, do you get the the bubble bath um, lava sulk when you're obviously when it's running in the water, but I like the fact that also that it's um it's clear it's it, it's um it's it's actually helping your skin in a sense of that it's cleansing your skin. It's making your skin feel um silky smooth and 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 smooth, so I like the fact that it's it's doing that you're getting <clears throat> the effects of the 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 chamomile and the lavender, but also the fact that <clears throat> it's leaving your skin feeling um radiant and glowing and feeling silky smooth. And I think some of these bath salts that I've used in the past they don't do that. Don't get me wrong, you do get a good salt, but they don't at the same time leave your skin feeling um, like they feel like it's invigorating your skin at the same time as well as soaking your like you know stressed out body but from what i've but from what i've seen with this and the the cousins imperial leather 
Lavender thing where they both claim that obviously that they're gonna leave his skin feeling soft and rejuvenated, right? Um, that's maybe even more enthusiastic in wanting to um try out this product. So what I will do is I will do a follow up video. But what, as I said, in the the in the um yeah in the Imperial Leather um lavender sulk is, I think I'm just gonna do um it as a YouTube short video where obviously you can do it within fifteen seconds or six seconds. So I'll just do a six second. Um, my follow up video and what I think of it rather than doing another five or ten minute video on it, I think that would be much easier and more palatable. So, yeah, this is the I Love Wellness Sleep um, Bath Sulk and Range. Again, I'm, I can't wait to try it. I know that they did do a body mist, which um, I didn't see, and it was still would have been full price. So, I do want to try it that at some point. That's a that's part of their lavender range. So, if we do sit there and I do manage to get that something in the future, um, keep an eye on the video if I ever get my hands on that product anyway i hope people found this video informative um please feel free to share with your friends and family also if you can give this video a like i would highly appreciate that that allow people to find my youtube um channel and content on youtube recommendation page this is because of the youtube algorithms favor the bigger youtubers so they get their channel and content advertised on youtube youtube recommendation page so that will allow um people to find um my youtube channel and so i'll get i'll gain more subs and more views and <clears throat> speaking of, of subs um if you like what what you see feel free feel free to subscribe to my youtube channel if you want to see stuff like this i've got food reviews comics unboxings video games um i'm trying to expand it just not trying to keep myself pigeonholed into one um bracket of um of doing certain videos um just before Christmas, we hit 500 subs, so big thank you to all the subs, old and new. I've always been saying this a lot on every video. I do really appreciate that, because without you, the, the viewers and the, and the subscribers, um, it wouldn't give me the impetus to to carry on um, doing the video. So a big thank you um, to to the subs, old and new. And hopefully the next... We're nearly at 600 subs, so maybe we'll get in the next... A um, few weeks or a couple of months, and then the next big milestone will be a thousand subs. So maybe we'll do a special video when we get to that um, landmark. Anyway, it just leaves me to say, wherever in the world, please stay safe and please keep warm. And I'll speak to you again on the next video. Bye for now.